people quickly catch feelings by thinking that when you speak against ancestral worship, you are attacking their blackness or you're not embracing your traditional roots. For thousands and thousands of years, God has been strongly condemning ancestral worship. In Leviticus 19 verse 28, God is addressing ancestral worship with regards to Israel as they were cutting their bodies and putting tattoos on themselves in worship of the dead. Time and time again, God rebuked idolatry and would punish Israel harshly. Most of their idols included the dead and objects of worship. In fact, even today, ancestral worship is found all over the world and is not just a black thing. Ancestral worship has existed from ancient times of Rome and the Greek culture. The Bible tells us that the spirits of the dead go to either heaven or hell and do not remain in the natural world. Which simply means that the belief that we have that the spirits continue to reside on earth after death and continue to influence the lives of others is not scriptural. Satan has always sought to supplant God and he uses lies about worshipping other gods and even ancestors to try to lead people away from the truth of God's existence. Give Maseko. Thank you for that beautiful explanation. You know, that is a hill I am willing to die on a thousand times. This lie of ancestral worship and its practice in every culture, it needs to come to an end. We need to expose the lies of Satan because those very same demons that come to you pretending to be your ancestors in your dreams, the very same demons that you consult for guidance, for help, for blessings that you assume are your ancestors. Those are the demons where the curses are laying, where you are born in bondage. Those very same demons have covenant and legal right to destroy your life, to be present in your life. Because why? When they come to you in a dream disguised as grandma, disguised as grandpa, disguised as mamgan, huh? you agree for them to put whatever they want to put in your life you actually wake up from the dream and you are happy that oh i dreamt of my grandmother i dreamt of my grandfather hey eh? when you go to a sangoma or a traditional healer or a medicine man or anybody that consults demons a psychic a tarot card reader that consults demons and tells you that is your grandmother this is your your uncle coming through this is your mother coming through that is demons that they are consulting the bible clearly says have no other god before me. I am a jealous God. God does not tell us to consult demons before him. Do not tell me you consult your ancestors and you worship God. You are deceived and you are lying to yourself. You are putting demons in front of God. So you consult Satan.